Just here for college athletics and for groups like Locker Room Access. I'm a little jealous, to be honest. I think, <laughs> no. We couldn't even, like, accept a free meal or, like, if we were eating at a place and someone was like, hey, I want to buy you a milkshake or something like that. Once they finally said that it's going to happen, we were like, damn, our, especially the year we won the championship, I think we could have made a lot, of, a lot of money. With the new name, image, and likeness rules in effect starting today, Players on current rosters at UVA are now able to fully benefit from their personal brand. The opportunities are, are endless and it'll be something as, as as the rules develop and change, obviously we have to be aware of that, but as we talk to the student athletes and kind of see where their interests are and what they want to do. We this shirt I'm wearing now, you know, that's tied, but that can be now. Kihei, Jaden Garner, it could be whoever, right? Locker Room Access has created a long-standing relationship with UVA Athletics, especially with former members Justin Anderson, Ty Jerome, and Grant Kersey at the helm. When the change went into effect, every member of UVA Men's Hoops got on board with sponsorships. They've seen us from a distance for, for, you know, for a while now, and I think the relationship that Ty and Grant and everyone had, it was very easy for us. We just wanted wanted to do something to help and start this thing off right for them. Between branded shirts, autographed products, and other opportunities to represent themselves, the team at Locker Room Access is prioritizing helping the athletes to make the most of it all. It's like, what can it do for, for them more than anything? Right now, it's, it's, a, it's a whole new world, so that's really where the where the juice is for us. As of today, the rules are just interim as the NCAA, universities, and local and federal government work through finding a consistent course of action. And the best advice for student athletes is prioritize what got them there in the first place. Don't lose sight of the end goal, because at the end of the day, no dollar amount that you can make in college can compare to if you are able to play in the NBA or if you're able to play at a high level. The better the player, the better the product. Focus on, on your sport, um, their respective sport, and kind of what they do on the court, on the field, and then kind of let the rest fall into place and the rest will kind of take care of itself in that regard.